Hey everyone, it's Andre here from SWL. Today I'm going to show you how to use a piece of wire to improve reception on your small radio like the Retic SV115 or the XH Data D219. These little radios. This one available really cheaply, very good radio. And this one, the Retic SV115, a very popular radio but with a very weak built-in antenna. Most of my viewers who are regular shortwave listeners will know all these things already. So this video is really aimed at people who are absolute beginners and who don't, don't quite know what to do with this wire. I also put up a video just this week using my reticus and a piece of wire, this one, where I picked up WWVH, which is 12,000 miles from where I am. So it shows you how effective that, that wire can be. So what you need some insulation tape and some wire, electrical wires. It can really be any type of wire. And most people will probably have some wire in the garage. You can just look around. Any electrical wire pretty much will do. I bought some speaker wire today. Um, so I'm going to use this speaker wire. It's 10 meters long. But as I say, you can literally use anything. So I will just open this up, get my little toolbox open. Now in terms of length, it's on small radios like this one, as I said, it's probably safer to not use too long a piece of wire. It might overload the radio, which means you're just going to get more noise and not an improved signal. So around 7 meters to 10 meters um, as a rule of thumb might be a good a good choice. So that, that's around 23 to, I don't know, just under 30 feet or so, I, I guess. Um, this one is, this is 10 meters, so it's probably around, yeah, around 30 feet. You just need to remove some of the insulation so that you have some wire that you can tie around your antenna. You can literally just twist this exposed wire at, on one end around your antenna. I'll just leave enough, so I'll just split it here and remove the rubber. There, as you can see, got it. And this is what, once we are done, and we are almost done, you will simply tie around your antenna. You can use a, a crocodile clip also if you want, just to make sure that the connection is stronger. But this is literally what you do. Just tie it around your antenna. The next step is simply to stretch this piece of wire outside. You can throw it up a tree. I'm going to take mine out and throw it over the roof and make sure that the end of the wire is insulated. Here we are. This is the end. It's not properly insulated so I'm just going to use a little bit of my insulation tape and just tie it around there just to make sure that the edges are insulated. There we go. So I insulated the end. Now I will throw this out of the window. There. Up on the roof outside as you can see. And then we will do a little test and see how it works. Right, so as you can see, I've got the wire here out of the window and up on the roof. We will now find a weak station, see what happens without the wire and what happens with the wire. Right, so on 11815, it is NHK from Japan, from Yamata in Japan. The time now is 12.55 UTC, 14.55 my local time, Central African time, CAT. So it's daytime still. And on the reticus, I'm pulling up the antenna. As you can see, the signal is there, but let's see the difference when I use my wire up on the roof. You simply tie it around the end of the antenna, like that. Or as I say, you can also use a 
you can use a crocodile clip if you have one and Major difference. And then I have All India Radio from Bengaluru in India is on 15030 kHz. So let's have a look at that one first with the uh, wire. Right, so that is All India Radio from Bengaluru. I'm going to remove the wire now and we will see on the built-in antenna what happens. So let's see All India Radio on the built-in antenna only. Well, that's good. It's clearly a strong signal, but it's still significantly better on the wire. You'll just need to experiment a bit with different radios because the, the wire, sometimes it will make a significant difference and sometimes not really. Sometimes the signal coming through the wire is just too strong. Like on the D219, I tried to pick up also NHK Japan, which is around here. And it's I just can't get it. various other signals so it's as easy as that you get a piece of wire any kind of electrical wire you expose the wire at the end a little bit and this exposed wire is what you twist around your built-in antenna and you will have significantly improved reception that's how you do it hope this helps